yours with me. I'm a Newfoundlander living in D.C. I love hunting, trapping, fishing, gardening too. And building things, come see, I invite you. I'm a B.C. to me. I'm a B.C. to me. The natural world's a lovely spot. It's resources I use a lot. I'm thankful for all that I got. I'm a B.C. to me. I'm a B.C. to me. I'm a B.C. to me. Shade boys out doing a check on the trap line. Just got out here late. I had to deal with some fur and stuff today. And uh, we were out trapping yesterday. I uh, set a few sets with a young lady I met here in town. She wanted to go out and do some trapping and see what it's all about and get outside. And that's what we did. So right now I'm just out doing a check on mine and I'm staying at camp all night and I'm following some Wolverine tracks. Now I got a box up here a few kilometers away, so I've tracked them 20 kilometers right to my box in the past. There's these tracks right there. Three for three for three. Just looking to see if I can see some Lynx tracks too, because I only got the one set do down there something went down there he's poking around only got the one box up here so it's you know burning fuel gotta have catches I got a catch up here the last time I had a small Wolverine and uh, I think I sold that one today so this one doesn't look like a the big one but we'll see if he went up and, uh, and paid a visit. Hopefully he didn't eat something on me. <laughs> See you on the trail. We're going to check a few here tonight and then I'm going to camp and then I'll check my skidoo stuff tomorrow and my wolf bait. We got a pile of tracks happening here so hopefully he didn't eat something on me. bunch of Wolverine tracks coming in here. Looks like somebody else been, I don't know, better not say nothing, but it looks like somebody's been checking my set. Somebody walked in here. Just wondering if I had a catch, if they would have took it or not. I've had people checking my sets out here before. That's the worst thing about roadside stuff, but uh, I haven't had too much trouble with it. I have never had one taken, but I had people even putting bait in my lynx pins. So, I don't know if they were trying to think they were going to catch one and take it, or what. So, i got to get that, uh, I don't know how I'm going to do that now, but i got to get that piece of bait back in there. So, I'm going to turn you off. That's not my track. That's a wolf track there. Not a big one. He's been poking around here. That might have been what was coming around the box there too, but there's a wolverine come up there. He was all around here too. I might have to write a, a little note on my trail. Tell those guys not to be checking my sets. Look like my chat in here. Huh. I need to get some links. I need another couple. Freshen up all my boxes. 
Hasn't been real cold either, so. I'm gonna give that a stir. There was a lynx around here last time. Moose come in here. Bit of moose sign. Which is good. I don't know if I had the dog in here with me that time. Nothing come to this box, though, I don't think. What the hell? Nothing. That link should have come back. There was one here when I said it. And that's been Mr. Weasel's here. Never did like deer scraps. Weasel likes it. See all his tracks. Little weasel. Last set for tonight. Not looking good. Haven't been much sign. Should be stuff moving though because it's good temperatures. I know there was a weasel at this one the last time. Nope. I set. Wherever I set, there was lynx tracks. There's lynx tracks right there, but... Mm. Nothing. Mr. Weasel. Well, can only hope for my screw ones to produce. Maybe we'll have a wolf or two or three. Decided to check my... Uh, Skidoo sets, it's only early, it's a nice night, and uh, not a thing has been to that moose, not a wolverine, not a lynx, not a wolf, just a few birds, so, but just up from it, I seen a martin track, so it might be a martin in there, because they got a hole dug in the moose, but uh, the first box up here, we uh, got a catch, but uh, I haven't, okay, let's get the I'll just take Got no light. I had a fisher at this box here, but he stole the bait, I think, on this. I'm not sure if it's the same one that I caught there. Done some going around here. Well, I rebate it. Carry on. <laughs> Just got the lights of the sled. Last box, nothing. I forgot, damn. I only lost my light. Two lights tonight. One wouldn't work, and the other one I lost it somewhere. I think it's when I went and baited up the last one. I said the other one was last set, but I forgot I had this Martin box here. Martin cone. Cone set. Yep, nice little feller. Got some markings on him. Heading her home. The hoar frost is wicked. This is just overnight. I pulled over yesterday. High humidity. 
dull day. Sun was nowhere to be seen. Hey, Shade. We got a moose coming there. She's been into my greenhouse and everything, sticking her head in there. We walked up the other day. She come running out of here, frightening the crap out of me and Shade. And she's been going in there. She eat all the sunflowers off. Just come down to throw some deer scraps on my wolf bait. Hope it's not a wolverine. Oh, it's not. Mr. Black Guy. What are you doing, boy? That's good. There was a lone one here. I don't know if that kind of looks like a young one. I've been seeing this wolf. I seen him once in my and uh, I figured he was around here because I seen one lone track coming, then that pack showed up and that pack left. And I haven't seen a track since, so this guy must have come in the back door or the only place where I can't see where they're coming in. And I had him in, I had a foothold right there. Just I wanted the trails close to the bait, but whatever, you take chances sometimes. Got in there and he got hooked up right away. And he's right in there. I just put a hole in him. And he's not even tangled up. Which is not good when you're trying to get it get a shot at him. He's a nice guy. I think he's an old male. Oh you know, he's a he's a big bugger. I haven't buggered up too much. No. Nope. It's got him by the toes though. Could have been in there deeper. Oh. oh. He looks like a good one. He's probably... He's probably sold. I got several guys on the... Looking for him. Yeah, he's a dandy. He's a big guy. Whoa. I make everything look small because I'm a big guy too. But I don't know if he's a scout or a lone male. I've always seen this track by himself, so maybe he's a scout. But he's been a uh, Probably got a full gut. He's like this thick down through. Got him by two toes. Could have got him a little deeper. And he bent this, I don't know what that is, 5'8 steel. And he bent this one. And it was only hooked in the first tree there. He wasn't even tangled up. He just stayed right where he was when I went in there, which is good. And he only went 20 feet, 25 feet maybe, from where he was, where I had the trap set. First bit of trees he went into, he was done. So, get him loaded up, skin him tonight. Nah. He's a beauty. Nice bushy tail. Can't get much better. Got white feet, a little bit gray feet. He's 
not rubbed or nothing, I don't think. Doesn't look like it. Missed nice big male. You got a spot on his nose. Oh. He's a chunky, chunky monkey. You gotta love it. It's good to take out a few. Last year I didn't get either one. I kind of pay it up for it this year. So hopefully we get some more. Take care of some moose. Good morning. It's on the way to work here, so I figured I'd give an explanation of uh, what I discovered uh, about that set that somebody walked into. It was, uh, I come home from work one evening and he pulled in my driveway and he said, Oh, I'm the guy that checked your set up there, he said. I, uh, he's, a, he's a trap line owner on the, that borders the trap line I'm on, so. I guess Wolverine uh, got in up by his camp and tore his seat right off his skidoo, like a two-up seat and everything. Just skidoo's just like mine. So he tracked that Wolverine right to my box, so he went in there to see if he was in there. <laughs> and then uh, his dog got out, so that's where I I seen the tracks in the night, but I didn't really look at it. I thought it was the first thing I thought was it was a wolf. I said it didn't look like a big one. Well, I guess his dog got out and he went in around the box and everything so all that snow was beat down was from him trying to catch his dog I think it was on at least two now that I reviewed the, the video and stuff I could see like a little bit of drag mark there so I don't know if you still had him on a leash or not so he come down and because I did write a note there and put the trap line number and who was trapping it but I didn't put my phone number there so he tracked me down uh, so that was good. So I give him my number then because he uh, he said he hasn't been trapping that much because he had a, a heart attack or, or something there to spring. So he's just been out there putting around. So I give him my number in case he got into a pickle or vice versa. We could call each other or whatever. Maybe there might be a chance that he or I are out there. So. So I just figured I'd put that in there. It was really anybody actually checking my sets. If I had something and somebody fixed my box back up, I would know anyway, because I know how I put my sticks and stuff. So. so I just wanted to include this in the video before I uploaded it. So uh, we'll see you on the trail here. More to come, more to come. I'm, I'm a bit behind as usual. So I got a nice bit of footage. We'll see you on the next one.